Here I am in the studio doing a test. So I can see me in here, I can walk up a little bit. This is where we're up to with the studio construction at the moment. It has slowed down somewhat, uh, unfortunately the way it was left. Uh, when the tradies handed it over to me there was still plenty to do. So I'm doing my best but it's slow. I paid people to do this because I don't have the skills. Uh, so that is holding me back. I have bought a whole bunch of new tools. So I'm getting smarter every day. I look at stuff on YouTube and Google how to do the things I need to do. But it's slow progress. It is very slow progress and we are slowly getting there. But what I'm actually doing at the moment is checking out. I've got the EOS on the tripod, the Rode mic transceiver is with that. And I have this little Rode mic here. So this is kind of a tech test to see I'm on a spindly little tripod. I probably need a bigger and better tripod to make this work. And I've got the Canon M50 sitting up there. So I can't actually see very much. I've got the window, the side window of the camera open so that I can kind of see where I am. Hey, warm the crotch. So yeah, that's, you can see if I walk all the way back here, you should be able to hear that I'm still on mic because hopefully you're listening to this, the little road mic. But I've been sanding this stuff. I'm not quite happy with it yet. I'm not quite happy with it yet. But we'll get there. So yeah, I bought a hand sander to, to do some of this stuff with. Yeah, slowly getting there. Um, so what's been holding things up? So the jip rock's up. It had been filled. I think that's where the last update finished. And when I sanded it back, it wasn't actually ready for painting. There hadn't been enough filler put in the holes. So all the gaps were slightly... Um, yeah, they needed more filler in them, basically. There were holes and gaps. So I've done that. It's been two or three uh, goes of filling, sanding back, seeing what the problems are, filling again. I've got the walls to where I'm reasonably happy with them. It will not be perfect. Unfortunately, it very much won't be perfect. Uh, what I was doing this morning was actually up on the roof uh, doing the same process. So I'd sanded it all back, feathered all the edges, there were still visible grooves. It was nearly there. It needed one more run through. And then I ran out of jointing compound. So I used the very last of the jointing compound I had. So I went out and I bought some more. Um, and I bought a sander, a little hand sander so that I can do the, the timber around the uh, architraving. The problem was I asked for architraving. What it's been done with is fairly rough cut um, decking timber not properly finished architraving. So what I'm actually having to do is by hand, come back and knock all that back to see how that's gonna work. So I'm doing stuff that I don't have the skills for. It is taking me a lot longer than I was hoping it might. And there's been a lot of family problems. Um, my mother-in-law has dementia and we're having to find a home for her and my sister's having some problems. So I've been running back and forth to her. She's been in and out of hospital. So there has not been any time for fog of war, unfortunately. So between this and being elsewhere, looking after other people, uh, the, yeah, there's not been a lot of fog of war happening. Uh, and that probably won't change anytime soon, which is unfortunate. Um, so for example, Eastern Front, uh, I got sent a PDF copy of that, which ended up in my uh, spam filter, in my junk folder. So I only found it like two days before the um, uh, embargo date was finished. So I haven't done anything on that. And again, I'm more of a product review guy, so you guys don't need me talking to you about the Eastern Front lists. That's not my speciality, uh, and list building is not really something anybody should be seeking my opinion on, to be honest. Uh, so I haven't actually done anything for Eastern Front. 
I'm really waiting for Bulge British and I would love to do something for that. We'll see. I have no idea what shape uh, it's going to be with my sister and my mother-in-law and this and whatever. So we just, we, at the moment, we, we don't know. Um, so it'll be weird. I might end up having a studio and then not be making content for a while. Um, it is what it is and we'll do our best. So anyway, that's a bit of a channel update. Again, this is really a camera test. I'm not expecting this to be the update that actually goes out, but at least it gives me a little bit. All right, happy gaming and I'll see you later.